Making that Christmas Eve start. I can't actually believe that EA has scheduled a Christmas Eve start. Not only do we have a Christmas Eve start, but uh, where is it? We have a game on Christmas holiday, like actual Christmas day in Philadelphia. What is the NHL doing with this schedule? <laughs> There's a little bit of Volbeat there. I don't know how edited in that is. Look at the view from way up here. We haven't had a view like this at the Canadian Tire Center yet. Jordan Bennington in the St. Louis net with a 9-1-0. So he is having pretty decent, a pretty decent season. We, we just continue to struggle. The struggle is real. We got to find a way to gain some consistency and start shutting out opponents. I'm going to call it here. We're going to get a shutout. Uh, I, I've said that before and it hasn't worked. I'm just going to say it, get it out of the way, and who knows, maybe something wild happens. I wouldn't count on it. Something wild probably won't happen. That was pretty wild. That's the most wild thing you'll see all night. That Zanetti weird shot that was not on net. There's a backdoor feed. And Joe Pavelski, man, this guy has been a flame. He's been on fire. Not like a Calgary flame, but like a literal, actual flame. He has been lighting up goaltenders in the last couple of games. I don't care how old this dude is. He does not stop. This, he might have himself a 25 goal season if he can keep this up. We are on Christmas Eve, so it's a Christmas Eve start, but uh, he could have a 25 goal season. That's number 12, I think, for Joe Pavelski. No, it's the number 11, I'm sorry. Okay, well, I thought it was number 12. Joe Pavelski, confirmed elite 40 something year old. All right, well, we've got our first shot right there, trapped down with the glove. Keep it calm. That one missed on the stick side. Dumped in by Bushnevich. And, uh, well, okay, we'll just let Chabot handle this. You might want to get back in a crease because these guys are going after it on the four check in this game. Need to get on a very hot win streak. Uh, although we are still in contention for first place in the division, I think that's how we did the outro for the previous video before this game was recorded. And, uh, yeah, we're not far off the lead in the division, just off by one point at the moment. And the way the season's gone, you wouldn't think so. Passes off to the middle, rebound, Morgan, who was back in the lineup. Dumped in by Costin. We're going to get this one. And then right up the boards, that was kind of high danger for Kachuk. Troy Terry, right shot on the left side, dishes to Kachuk. He had a chance on the blocker side, denied by Bennington. And double teamed Bash Brothers over there. Kachuk and Terry. Oh my. If they set that up, that would have been beautiful. On the Sports Center top 10 for sure. Oh, a kick out save off of Moore. So everything's a little perimeter based right now for the Senators. Shot. And it goes there. Why are we all the way out over the post like that? We might see a. Okay, lots of passing. Blocker save. Very aggressive with that blocker hand. Tori Krug up to Bushnevich. Pavel Bushnevich has the right shot of Thomas and we've got the save and a whistle. So we face off one by the Blues and a snipe by Blomdahl. I didn't think we played that poorly. I mean, you be the judge. You can leave a comment if you think we played this poorly, but I think we played that pretty well. That is a retro mustache right there. Oh, yeah, we did not get a save there. Straight up. Tell me we didn't. We just simply didn't get a save there. It's just the way the levee breaks. Tough one for us. So there's the shot from Blomdahl, or however you pronounce the name. He shoots it, and oh, my God. Watch the arm. So we're, as we're dropping, the arm actually doesn't stay elevated. Watch the... I'm trying to move it slowly. The arm comes down and it leaves just that perfect gap in the top corner. Why is your arm coming down and then you have to re-elevate it? What, where is he tracking this puck to? Live by the EA goalie animations and die by the EA goalie animations. We didn't get a glove save animation and it backfired. Dude, those two guys right there on the glass behind the CCM logo are going nuts. Gathered by Morgan. Good to see Morgan back in the lineup. Find Sod rebound chance. Bernard Docker trying to shoot a block from the Blues, another block, and it's still gathered and scored. 
just inside the post, Brady Kachuk puts the Senators back on top. Well, that was a kind of an awkward play. That missed poke check was critical for Bennington. The fact he missed that, it exposed that part of the net and Kachuk, he didn't miss. We're back in top. We're back on top of the lead. We got this game under control and we got that save under control. Hopefully this isn't a very long game and a very intense game. Keep this game pretty simple. Rebounds off of the Zaka chance. We got a lot of season left. There's no reason to really lose hope in this Sins team, especially considering that we are up for first place in the division and can be a playoff team. I just don't know that this is the team. And if you guys would focus on getting the puck, weird one is it rims all the way back toward me and that's the end of the first period of play. You know, if we just got that save on that one shot that went past us, that's the difference right now. All right, I want a solid middle frame of play for our entire team, not just me in the net. I want our team to just keep it up, keep playing well defensively. We've limited St. Louis's chances really through the start of this game. Oh my God, I'm telling you, the rebound control has been just ugly. Can, you, can we learn to not give these guys second chances right to the tape? I mean, this has been our downfall this season. It's not, there's no problem really with making the first saves. It's that rebound that we give up and the second chance we got. I need a little help defensively too, and I need a, and I need a bounce, really. So the low pads, shot, save. And we just kick it. The rebound's so perfect for him. But where's the push? I'm trying to push back to recover. There's no recovery on this rebound, man. Yeah, it's it's gonna be a long. This could be a long game. Just got that feeling. Yeah, the Blues. Everything is perimeter based right now for St. Louis. No shot coming. They're just working it all around the outside. And this is. Probably the most aggressive save I've ever made. I didn't even, I can't even believe I still had that. I was moving around like crazy. Well, the good news is we stay with this rally guy. You see the red skate laces and what the hell is he wearing? What kind of, yo, what, <laughs> what kind of skates are these? What are those? That skate color with that lace color what is what is this what what kind of combo is that so anyway ignoring this guy's weird skate lace and color combinations looks like something out of the freaking 90s backhand say we stay with this guy there's the rebound again rebounds right in front of us i'm glad i don't freak out too much because it's right in front of me and usually from the camera angle that i play from if you can't see the puck from behind the net. It means it's right in front of you. Another little kick style save here as well. And then there's the cover and we play it off to our left. Here comes Rally with the interesting skate lace color design. And we just decided to ice it. I don't know why you panicked. AI straight up panicked on that one. Long, 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 long way from home. Again, these rebounds are too juicy. Oh, mishandled pass from Mal or, or Terry, I'm sorry. Low pad shot, save, rebound, all kinds of interesting options for the Senators on this offensive possession. Uh, Kachuk, I'm sorry. Everything going on right now. Blocked away, rebound, and there it is. Put home by Pavel Zaka. So our high goal scoring ability continues. Now, I just feel like it's a little too high scoring so many of the games that we play in for both our team and the AI teams. We need a bit of variability. We need low scoring games and high scoring games. Hockey isn't just an entirely high scoring affair. It's not an, an, and sometimes you get low scoring games and sometimes you get high scoring games. We don't have enough variability in this career mode. We've regained control of this game by taking a three to two advantage. We need to hold on to it. We need to backstop the guys. They need to do a good job in front of me defensively. And that includes cleaning up rebounds if they shoot it low to my pad, I'm going to give up a rebound. And in that case, we put one in the corner, which is really where we need to be putting the majority of them. That was through traffic. Cover, cover, cover. Uh-oh. Oh, God. I, I thought Thomas was definitely going to have a chance on that. Feed Zanetti. Zanetti needs to get on the scoreboard again or, or on the scoring sheet. It would, be, it would be nice. Bernard Docker blocked away by Bushnevich. I'm not sure who 88 is. 
Might not be Bushnevich. That's rally number 61. Oh! Get on your feet! Oh, he missed it! He missed it! What a strange sequence of events. Was this a lunging save? We were- no, we were pretty aggressive though at the top of our crease. So the save onto- oh my goodness, with the toe of the pad again. Rebound right there. That was kind of unnecessary, but maybe necessary at the same time. And then what happened after that? Yeah, we were going to see a shot, and I was aggressive to the short side. And I, you know, I don't know. I don't know why he misses this. I gave him some net there, but maybe that's exactly it. We made it tough for him to, to find the back of the net on that. Windmill by Brandstrom, and we didn't finish it after all of that. Oh, no. Oh, my. But we're bad at, will he shoot? He looks like he's in a shooting scenario and we have a save. So I'm going to see, uh oh, oh yes. Got the short side in time. We got a lot of game to try to keep doing this. I can't just keep doing this for a whole game. It's, it's heart attack inducing. It's there it is. There's your, that was an obvious feed. He just took forever to make that play happen. Three minutes on this rush and they use Bo Horvat. We get the rebound. And they fire it low, save, rebound, Horvat the second try. No, we didn't get the rebound as well, did we? We did. It's a stick save. Wow. That'll be a shot right in the glove, and you can have that. The Blues with quite the rush play. Oh, Bushnevich, we were tracking him a little bit. At least Sun, and that. Oh! Oh! <laughs> We didn't just make that save, did we? That's not it, is it? What the hell? Bernard Docker, you complete idiot. You got to move this puck as soon as you got possession. He's got to move it to someone. Pavelski's open right here. You can just saw, dish it up into a soft area of the boards. You got two guys going to it. What does he do? Turns around and goes this way. Turnover. Created. Bushnevich has it. I know I got to be aggressive to the short side because they love to tuck it on the short side. They can put it five hole. So I go aggressive. This kind of bites me back a little bit as Rally gets it. But for some reason, I didn't mean to go spread eagle. And oh my God, we, ju <laughs> we just keep this out with the pad. I mean, there is not a whole lot of room to spare before the goal line. And that is a lucky Lucky save. Uh, highlight, real, worthy save. We we got to calm it down. We can't seem to settle it down in this game. It's one wild save after another. At least you're entertained, right? I hope you're entertained. If you're not entertained, then, uh, well, I don't know what to tell you. You got to lower your standards a little bit. Somebody just shoot it. Zanetti, one-timer. Oh, we actually see the Blues dump this one in. We got it. Rim it up the boards. For Zanetti to Stutzla. Now, one more touch and I won't have a chance at an assist. And there it is. Pavelski's ruined my chance for an assist. But he does get a shot on net. And he's got it back. And then robbed out of the air by Bennington. With 10.2 seconds left. Terry, a slap shot. Missed the net. Four seconds left. That's going to be the end of the period. It will die down in the neutral zone. Dumped in by Costin. And again, the puck ends up in my end. To finish the period out. Man, we've, we've made it dramatic. And it didn't need to be this dramatic, but we have made it very dramatic. Let's not let's not have any more of this crazy nonsense going to this third period. That food vendor, he's not even doing his job. He's he's, he's got to sit down and watch the show that I'm putting on. Dumped in by Thomas. We got this one just barely. Wow, put some mustard on that one. Zanetti over to Brandstrom. And there's Pavelski waiting with four blue players around him. And a great feed to the back door on Stutzla. A shooting lane. We're going to take a penalty. A hook. That was a blatant hook. The Blues will get a power play there first in this game. Blocker save. Again, we're so slow once we recover. Uh, yep. That's going to be a save. And that will be the touch for the hooking penalty to begin. If that makes sense. I don't know. For the, the penalty kill will begin. Thank you to Tim Stutzla taking the first penalty for the Senators. I think that's the first power play we've had in this game. Oh, recover to this post. The short side. Thank you, defense. I owe you a big steak dinner.
But uh, the best I can do is a happy meal. Shen, gonna pass from the half wall. Thank you, McNabb. I owe you a steak dinner. Penalty kill. We have killed the penalty. And my defense in front of me picked me up. Everyone playing for their goaltender right now. All right, we'll hold on to that and then play it to Bernard Docker. Now, don't make a dumb mistake with it. He did. He made a dumb mistake with it. Costin. And, and I'm telling you what. I just don't trust... I'm not going to trust you for the rest of this game. You just completely screwed me over. Man, that is the second dumb mistake Bernard Docker's made in this game. You can't trust him with the puck. I knew... The moment I played it to him, I knew he was going to goof it up. I just knew. I had that gut feeling. And, it, of course... What does he do? Skates it right up the boards into a turnover. Sure as day. We need to see five more shots minimum in this period and keep everything out. That's a try. Pavelski, get that goal scoring itch and satisfy that itch. I don't ever want to see number 48 on the ice for the Senators again for the rest of this game. He doesn't deserve it. He hasn't earned the ice time. Rally right in the glove. Uh, no, I don't trust any of you anymore. Rally misses. It's, what are you doing? It's not behind you. Why were you reaching behind you? It rebound off the inboards. Even my guy in the game's freaking out. He's having a panic attack. It careens off the inboards to the left of him and he reaches behind him. Oh my god. You guys, defensively, what the hell? I love that he was just standing back door, no one covering, and it's just, it's sloppy. I just wanted to make 900 save percentage for crying out loud. It was looking like we were going to do it. And you guys have just completely thrown it down the drain in this game. Oh, we were able to make rebound saves for once. I mean, I'm just going to piss it away in this game. I don't care. I'm just going to play how I want to. A shot a minute, basic. One shot per minute. Oh, rebound. If you, you could have scored. You guys could have scored on that. So, Bo Horvat, it's pretty safe to say we can be as aggressive as we want. See, we didn't even, we intimidated him with our aggressiveness. And Costin missed the net there. There's got to be a shot coming. Oh, it was, oh, thank you for clearing McNabb. That was the one time you did need to ice it. Kick win by, uh, oh, I thought I saw McNabb taking the face off. It was actually Boom Jenner. So, Jenner, rebound, and off of Bennington and in. Denis Morgan gets it tied with five minutes left. So, I guess maybe don't lose some faith. Don't lose some faith. Don't lose any faith. There is still a chance we could win this game. The important thing now at this point is just getting a win. Good favor with the coach is more important than anything else right now. A win would help in that regard. Really important that I don't piss this away in the last four and a half minutes. Yeah, Clem Costin, this should be a shot. Yeah, we just kind of bait him into a shot so we can see something. Does he pass off or shoot? It looks like he's going to go to a shot. Oh! I uh, pretty for oh yeah oh yeah stone cold I mean I've been making highlight reel saves left right and center in the last couple of games this is no exception wow <laughs> whoa and it dies out oh my god that was the biggest save of this entire game I don't care what you're saying that's the biggest save of this entire game take a clear shot oh did he make a save? I can't tell. Potential. OT. Rally. Oh my god. Please pull it off the pad there, McNabb. Good shot. They got plenty of... Oh yeah, we're going to see a shot. They're running out of time, so we're going to see a shot. Did we head that out of play? Oh. Oh, off the glove. Oh, and deflected. Oh my. This is big. 2.8 seconds left. D-zone draw. At least one point on the line. We win it, so we're going to get a point. I don't care about giving the Blues a point because they're a Western Conference opponent. So we are going to see overtime for the first time here in Season 5. 3-on-3 three three overtime. I'm not sure how ready I am for this. Oh, boy. We do have possession, though, to start it. We've got... Is, tell me Zanetti's out there. It doesn't matter. That... Oh, that was good enough. A big save on Rally. Carries it up the wing. He's got speed. Passes to Chabot. Denied by Bennington. Stutzler gets the turnover back. Dishes back for Zanetti. You got the backdoor one-time feed taken away by Falk, but a stick lift by Chabot, and it's turnover city. On his, not on his own. He's got a teammate rushing with him. It drops off for Falk. We make a blocker save. Standing up. Falk center lane drive and a blocker save. That's, again, we've made huge saves down the line. This has been a crazy good game. Pressure Stutzla. Uh-uh. Did we just poke that away? I didn't want to see a shot in that scenario. Rally. 
Oh my god. Get up, get up, get up. Good battle there. Poke check. Break away. Zanetti. Zanetti. Oh, uh, he just, he ran out of steam. Craziest overtime. Feeds Zaka one-timer held onto by Bennington. Brings it up. He's got a teammate. Doesn't like it. Uh, I like the save, cover and the save. 35 seconds left. Kachuk carries himself. Away we go. Zaka, low shot save. Trying to work it out. Tucks it and he scores. Pavel Zaka has won it in overtime. The crucial point going to the Ottawa Senators in what was a wild one. We made some really hectic saves in this game, kept the team in it, and it's allowed us to win, and we almost got back to 900, if you can believe it. Here's the replay of how Zaka tucked this home. Oh, it goes five holes. Bennington is hinged on that post. Oh, what a crazy game. We come back drenched in sweat, blood, and tears. Happy tears. After that game, I'm a, I get a minus three from the coach on the line score. How? I just won you a freaking game. My saves kept you in this game. Believe it or not, that is almost a 900 save percentage. It is like 0 .003 points off from being a 900 save percentage. We let four past us. A little bit goofy at times, but Man, we almost saw 40 shots in a game for the first time. Granted, it did go to overtime. I don't care about giving the Blues the extra point. They're a Western Conference team. We needed to get the win, and we have done that, and we have a four-game winning streak. That was by far, I think, the most hectic game in this entire series. So I can't wait to upload this for you guys to see. I hope you're watching, because, and I hope it was worth it, because that was very entertaining. 4-1 dub on Christmas Day. Man, we're rolling hot, this Senators team. We've suddenly found our pace. Fifth best team in the league now.